Hey, yo, what up, y'all? Yo, check this out. Kyrie Irving just released a photo of his new lifestyle shoe. And I got to come at my people for a second. And I love my people. When I mean my people, I mean us, if you know what I mean. Black people. Listen, a lot of y'all on social media was clowning his lifestyle shoe. Now, I've never been a light fan of lifestyle anything, any type of shoe, Jordans or whatever. But my problem with us is, some of us, is that if those same shoes was Balenciaga or Dior, would I still have the same energy? Think about it. Just think about it. Look at some of these European shoes that we wear. They're not outrageously nice designs. They just have a name to it. That's something to think about. We got to get our stuff together, man. Come on, man. Y'all stop acting like... All right, so let me just prove a point real quick. Now, I want you to look at these Balenciaga shoes. Look at this. Okay, right? And now look at Kyrie Irving's shoe. All right. Some of you might say both of them are ugly. But these Balenciagas are very ugly. Okay? And let me tell you, a lot of y'all was rocking these Balenciaga shoes. Seeing y'all. All right? Just to make my point. Just to just to get my point across. All right? Now, let's take a look at the Dior's. Let's now take a look, another look at the Kyrie Irving lifestyle shoe. Different color. Similar but different. But, if you was to put that same name on the Kyrie Irving shoe, y'all might feel like, yo, that's, that's fire. I'm just making a correlation to y'all right now. To make y'all understand I mean y'all tell me How y'all feel about it Y'all feel I make sense right now Remember When I was younger And FUBU was out And everybody know FUBU For us by us FUBU actually wasn't a bad brand The clothing was pretty dope But just for the fact That it was black owned When I was coming up And I'm being honest People thought it was bummy People actually But They would put on Tommy Hilfiger Somebody who don't even like us Don't even want black people Wearing their clothes Polo, I still wear polo to this day, I ain't gonna lie I like polo, I like Ralph Lauren But we would wear polo, Ralph Lauren Tommy Hilfiger, Nordica You know, you can tell my age by the brands that I'm talking about uh, So many brands that we wore And I could go on and on But just to get back to my point When FUBU was out People wasn't, I mean people I knew They wasn't really jacking it They wasn't They wasn't They was not And that's a problem man, you know what I'm saying Listen I'm a firm believer in it's not only the name, it's how you put it together. All right? If you come outside, you look clean, clean pair of pants, clean pair of a, a clean shirt, right? Everything matches, you know what I'm saying? Everything is, is clean and nice looking, you fresh. Kind of feel like that guy that be all over, you know, Instagram. I ain't fresh. I ain't fresh. That's that's how y'all make people feel nowadays. Because some people feel are so insecure that they don't feel fresh without European brands on. That's something to think about. Anyway, that's my opinion, man. Subscribe to the channel, man. This is Philly Throwbacks. I don't want to talk all day. But just think about what I said. Subscribe.